Hi and welcome to Euphonic Crumpets! Okay, so today I'm going to talk about worms. There's lots to talk about. Worms are actually really, really alien. I mean, they're squirmy, they squirm, and there's actually a story about them I have for you. I always have stories. Always. This story was found directly from Survival of the Sickest. So basically what happens is... This worm is called the Dichrocolium dendriticum. Okay, which is basically this tiny worm that lives in cows and sheep. So basically what happens as stated from this book, is that the worm wants to go to another sheep because it wants to continue its species even after the sheep is killed. Oh no. It lays its eggs inside the poop of, or the excrements of the sheep and, you know, tweedle its way out. They lay dormant until a snail comes along and eats up the eggs. Fun stuff, hey? The eggs hatch inside the snail. They hatch inside the snail? So they hatch inside the snail, you know, swimming inside snail guts. Yay. Out of the slime of the snail. So, that's not done though. It's still not back inside the sheep. It waits around for an ant. Okay, and then an ant come and eat part of the slime. So what the larvae do is that they actually get this hijack, one of them at least, hijacks the ant's brain and makes it pretty much suicidal. Like, I'm not kidding. The ant will be a normal ant by day, but then by night, the ant will find a nice blade of grass, climb at the very top of it, and wait around for a sheep or a cow to graze away. So yeah, you know, bombarding brains to make ants suicidal for the win. <laughs> they must be puny if an ant, if they can get inside of an ant. That was fun. You know it. 